I'm Danny Rabin from Marvin, and uh, this lesson is about how to hold a pick and how to pick. Now, um, this is something that everybody should give a lot of thought to, and if you find that your right hand technique is holding you back, you might want to think about relearning how to hold the pick. Um, now, I hold the pick most of the time like this. I use the, the flesh of my thumb and I close it against the side of my index finger, this bone. Now, that's not the only way to do it, but it's one of the ways. And I'll go over all the ways. That, there are three ways, really, that make sense. Now, this kind of picking comes from, uh, you know, more ancient instruments. If you ever see an oud or um, a laute or, like, you know, these, like, old string instruments, they have a thin pick that's made out of plastic. It's about this long. And you hold it in your hand like this, and then you bend it over your index finger. So this point, this fulcrum, is like this, okay? So you just place the pick there to where it can't fall, you put your thumb on it, and then you play, okay? So advantages of this, you know, if you, there's, and then there's two schools of thought about like how to play. Django Reinhardt plays like this with his wrist up and, you know, these kind of motions like Have more weight. 